Hello, everyone, and welcome for uh, welcome to our training for implementing the IP2M meter, which stands for Integrated Project or Program Management Maturity Environment Total Risk Rating Tool using earned value management systems in a team environment. This is day one of two days. Uh, we're going to be training for two and a half hours each today and tomorrow. Uh, I'm Munir Elazmar. I'm a faculty member at uh, Arizona State University. I'm joined by two of our team members. Uh, Ed, would you uh, like to introduce yourself? Yeah, my name is Ed Gibson. I'm a faculty member at Arizona State University, and I was a co-PI on this uh, research project and development project, and, and glad to be here talking about what we did. Thank you, Ed. And Hala? Hello, my name is Hala Samboskani. I'm a PhD student at ASU. I work with Dr. Gibson and Dr. Munir, and Dr. Munir is my supervisor, and I work on this project. <laughs> On the right side of that uh, first slide here, you will see uh, this report number six, uh, which uh, will tell you that we've actually published quite a few reports based on this work that you're about to uh, to see here today, all of which is available to you on our project website. Um, in terms of uh, the the, line, the the work for today, this, this first session here is a little bit of an introduction uh, for the whole uh, training for both uh, today and tomorrow. We're gonna start with a quick uh, agenda for the course. Today, we'll do the intro. We'll give you the overview of the tool, uh, the IP2M meter, and then we'll focus a good bit of our time on uh, one part. It's got, so the tool has got two parts. Today we'll focus on one part, which is EVMS environment. Uh, we'll give you the we'll lay out the concept and how it works, and then we'll spend some time in a workshop uh, using it, applying it on a fictitious project that we will be sharing uh, with you. We've actually shared the PDF case study of that project uh, last week. Um, so if you've uh, reviewed it, that's fantastic. If not, we will share it again with you when, when the time comes here in about an hour or so. Tomorrow, we will pivot to the second component of the tool, which is maturity, EVS, EVMS maturity. And, and similarly, we'll talk about the concept and how it applies and then uh, workshop it together on a continuation of that same fictitious project that we'll start today. And tomorrow we'll also spend some time to uh, do a little bit of a of a summary of what we learned, uh, some recommendations and guidance for your projects, and then we'll ask you how we did for that final course evaluation. So that's a little bit of the agenda for our time together. In terms of what we plan to achieve during these five hours together, the course objectives, we have four of them. First is everyone walking out of this course should be able to understand what, why, and when to use this tool this IP2M meter. Also, we should uh, build up knowledge of how to successfully use it on large complex projects and programs. Uh, using it versus successfully using it, uh, so it could be a little bit different. So we've learned some best practices um, over the last couple of years that we'd like to share with you here. Understanding tools, techniques, and lessons learned to effectively evaluate maturity and environment in a work session and across an organization. So we're gonna apply it on, on a part of a project here uh, together, and then you can extrapolate that to you know, a larger project, to a full program, to an organization. And obviously, we um, it, this is a, a space where we're gonna get the opportunity to practice IP2M meter skills in a hypothetical situation. You'll hear us say hypothetical, but in all honesty, this is an actual case, um, a project that we've worked on that we, we've changed the, a little bit of the information in there to make it more hypothetical because we can't share with you what, what case that was, uh, but these, these are real data. Um, an opportunity to take your project or program and organization to the next level where we have data to back that up. Um, there's actually a significant improvement in projects. We'll talk about that a little bit. Um, and we're able to, to use maturity environment as indicators uh, for that. Now, zooming in on today, today there's three ob objectives we'd like to accomplish. We'd like to get an overview of the tool and its uh, performance implications a little bit. We'll start with high level of performance today. We'll give you more details around that tomorrow. Learn about the environment component, as I mentioned, that first one, and then participate in the workshop to evaluate EVMS environment using the IP2M meter. We we really believe that learning by doing is, is a big thing. So not just we'll, we won't just illustrate the concepts, but we'll get to work with these concepts and apply them on that project.